Coach, how are you doing today? I'm great, thanks. Awesome. Can I get your full name and what uh, team you coach? Adam Herendine, Texas Tech Women's Tennis. Awesome. Okay, tough question. You ready? I'm ready. Okay, how, okay you were a player, yes. right? So I'm going to ask you, actually, how many days a year did you feel at your best when you were out there competing? Not practice matches, not, tournament, uh, not uh, training, specifically competitive environment, like tournament matches. Yeah. Roughly how many days a year? T two or three, no more. Two or three, no more. So what did you do, right, to become a better match player when you weren't feeling great? Uh, we talk to our players about you got to embrace it. You got to expect for things to not be perfect. And, so you, and you just got to play a lot of matches. Exactly, that's my next question. How important are practice matches to tournament matches? I think practice matches are great. You got to play them, but tournament matches are twice as important. I mean, you just got to play under pressure. Is there anything that you can, you know, our followers and subscribers, they want to know how to become a better match player. So any tips or recommendations how to make the, the practice matches as similar as tournament matches? Yeah, I mean, I, I, I coach girls, so you have your girls that you don't want to lose to, and the girls typically try not to play that girl. I tell our girls all the time, like, go home and play the girl you feel like you have to beat, right? The one that you're scared to play is the very one that's going to make it feel like a match. Okay, so challenge yourself, basically, yes. and play against people you don't really want to play. And you're supposed to beat. And Everybody wants to play the person they're better than. Very interesting. Coach, amazing tips. Thanks so much, and good luck with the season. Good yeah. luck today. Yeah, thanks for having me. Thanks, man. Really